hello traders hope you all enjoy trading this is in this video i will share some of my secrets and my trades for this week as i did usually so i will share some reasons why i entered some trades this week and how much pips we made this week in this video uh, at the beginning this is my gold uh, entry i shared this opportunity with you guys uh, it gave me 180 pips zero down why we entered as i mentioned in the main video we have a broken resistance and it works as a good support the price touch it and moved outside 180 pips and then with the news the price go back with this amazing bearish candlestick this huge uh, bearish engulfing and the price continue to downside anyway if the price go back again above this support this week if the price can close stay above 1930 the next week i will buy uh, this pair one more time also i have a very good trade in oil oil on weekly time frame i put this resistance area it pushed the price to downside very hard last time for more than five times so i decided to enter the trade from this high on one hour time frame give me this closure i entered it from there it gave me 480 perhaps zero drawdown. down it's a very easy just uh, learn how to put your resistance and support areas then usdchf i shared this opportunity with you guys from the beginning until the end now this week it hit my final target 250 peps so why we entered it was a very simple setup the price can't close above this support for many weeks when the price closed above with this amazing bullish candlestick i waited the price to go back three test this support on daily time frame and give me multiple weeks then we decide to enter and at the end we had 250 peps euro aud i entered this week it was a very simple setup and very easy setup the price rejected from this support many times and the price can't close below for long time and after the price closed below with this huge bearish candlestick last week i waited the price to go up three test this previous support and new resistance and it gave me a zero drawdown entry 150 peps zero drawdown it was a very easy setup just i went this trade because i was very patient also i entered gpp aud for the same reason the price closed below previous support the previous support and the new resistance and i entered it from there many times before this created a very important resistance area so i entered both entries first one from the highest resistance and second one zero drawdown from the lowest one first one 200 peps second one 170 peps almost audchf i shared this opportunity with you guys i think two weeks ago this pair very slow but it's okay we entered because the price 0.57 250 was a very important previous resistance for this pair the price finally closed above with this hammer candlestick it, it was amazing and here we have the same case this was a very important previous support and the new resistance for sorry old resistance and new support for this pair 0 0.56 950 the price closed above back to take all the process below thank allah i put 50 peps so th the price didn't take my stop loss and then again the price back above and continue to upside 150 peps second one i have a loss trade nzb jp y i have a loss trade just hit my stop loss at the evening depend on daily price action it was a very good daily closure I have this amazing bearish candlestick, so I decided to enter a, a sell trade from the nearest resistance, but the price take my stop loss 50 peps, and it's okay. CHFJPY, I have three entries, shared with you two entries from uh, them. First one closed 250 peps, second one closed also 230 peps, and third one 200 peps, I think, or, or even more, 200 peps. And I will give you a good opportunity right now for next week we can put a trade like that 164 this is a free trade for you guys perhaps 250 peps target you can put it as a limited 
order if we have a weekly closure below 164 this trade will be valid for next week if we haven't so cancel it it's for free for you guys also i have cat chf cat chf it was a very old trade i shared this opportunity with you guys also i entered a buy trade from this lowest support and now it almost hit my final target 250 peps i have also the last one in the dchf it was a very simple setup also 0 0.53 100 was a very important previous support and resistance it pushed the price to downside and the price can close above it for more than uh, two weeks and finally the price closed above i waited the price to with this candlestick i waited the price to go back to retest pro broken resistance and i entered and now i am in 100 peps zero down anyway hope you all benefited from this amazing inches and hope you uh, and hope this video will help you to improve your, your skills and be more good in the uh, trading just be patient in the last uh, few weeks market was very slow but now the price giving a very good opportunities to can enter i give you chf uh, as a gift and also i will give you this one i need a weekly closure above 0 0.54 500 to can enter a new buy trade and also if the price go back to it is 0.53 500 we can enter a buy trade from here Congratulations to who benefited from all our videos and made a good profit this week. And even if you didn't enter with us, you can uh, improve your skills and watch this video. It will help you a lot to uh, create your trades. Trade safe and have a great weekend.